This is the Baihetan Dam. It's erected on the Jingsha River in the upper stretches of the Yangtze River. Along with other power stations nearby, it helps to form the world's largest new energy corridor. The mega project has a capacity of 16 million kilowatts. It could generate more than 62 billion kilowatt hours of electricity a year. As clean energy, the hydropower Baihetan provides will reduce the annual consumption of standard coal by 19.68 million tons and reduce carbon dioxide emissions by 51.6 million tons per year. Zhou says China's potential of developing clean energy still remains largely untapped. The government says it aims to peak emissions by 2030 and become carbon neutral by 2060. To meet the goals, China's hydropower generation is expected to double to reach 760 million kilowatts. Carbon neutrality and emission peak have been buzzwords in China of late. The main questions being asked are, how exactly does China get there and will it get there on time? Well, this freshly built dam in southwestern China may offer some clues as to how seriously the country is taking its goals. In terms of scale, the dam is only second to the iconic Three Gorges Dam in central China's Hubei province and is said to be the smartest in the world, thanks to technologies that enable precise AI control on cement mixing, pouring and cooling. The technologies we use allow us to recycle water throughout the entire process, and they reduce costs as well as pollution of the rivers and lakes due to a decreased volume of wastewater. The application of new technologies greatly improved the operation efficiency, and in that way we significantly lowered the energy consumption during the construction, and the good quality of the dam also cuts down the cost of maintenance over the long run, which serves the same goal of saving energy and reducing emissions. Baihetan is also part of China's effort to transfer power generated in western regions to the east. That initiative is expected to expand further west to reach the Yarlon Zambo River in Tibet. Daikai CGTN, Liangshan Yi Autonomous Prefecture, Sichuan Province.